Boston. You just ran the 5K. How did that go? Pretty good. Uh, 14.20, I think. Nice. So, uh, sixth or seventh place. Yeah. It was uh, it was a fun race. It was definitely you know, definitely cold and windy. And I've been training in Florida. It's been 90 degrees, so it's it, you know it's a little a little different. But it was awesome to run with a bunch of guys. They took it out pretty chill for them. Yeah. You know, they're they're 13, 15, 13, 20 guys. Yeah. So for me, you know, it was it was awesome. So I went through a 9:20, and then they start kicking. You know, it's it's perfect. I didn't really taper down for this or anything, and flew home two days ago, and so, so fun. Guys, I don't know this. Have you ever run a marathon? Uh, no marathons. No. no? I know you're doing the short stuff right now, the Olympic yeah. stuff. But I mean, being here in Boston, there's got to be kind of some part of you that wants to run this race. Yes. Yeah. Yes. There's plans. Yeah. There's plans <laughs> in the future. There's plans. Yeah. I talked to my coach, and you know, we were we were talking and using kind of analysis, and he said that based on what you know what I do, I'm probably in like 214 shape or something. I said, all right, good. So if I shave four minutes off that, then I'm all of a sudden in it for Boston, right? And he was laughing. So we'll see. I mean, you know, after 2012, it's time to have some fun. So. So what are your plans? I mean, obviously you're doing I2 this year. Are you going to go to the longer distances, half iron, Ironman? Is that kind of the, the plan, or are you going to stick with the shorter stuff? I like the shorter stuff. Yeah. I'll probably stick with that um, probably through 2016. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, but I'll have fun with it. So. And um, what do you say to your man Hunter today? Uh, I'm amazed at Hunter 1. It's awesome to see him come back. And, you know, he's 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 such a talented athlete that it's it's cool to see that, um, especially after breaking his collarbone, you know, having an SI yeah, he's problems. he's a lot. Of injuries. Yeah, so injuries. I mean, it's it's great to see him racing well, and uh, I'm excited to see him. I think he might be racing Monterey or stuff later in the year. So he put himself back in that Olympic spot hunt, which is which is good. You know, we need that. And is that your goal, Olympics? Oh, definitely. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I want to be there on the on the day in London and, and racing really well. And so, you know, walk me through the rest of your schedule this year. Um, I'm gonna race in Monterey, Mexico, for a World Cup. Uh, I think the race in Yokohama is gonna be canceled. Yeah. Uh, so then it's. A dream Madrid and uh, Hamburg and London, which is our first qualifier, and then Beijing. So I'm just doing most of the most of the uh, WCS stuff this year. Nice so. picture of you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> right there. Yeah. All right. Well, good luck this year. Awesome. It's uh, another year. You know, it's a fresh, fresh start. Who do you yeah. think is your biggest competition? Um, you know, it's it's really trying to run with people like Brownlee's and Ferdano and Gomez. Those you know, guys fast, those are the guys. Fast runs. Yeah. And and, and you know, as much as there have been breakaways in the sport, that that doesn't happen when people don't want it to happen. You know, they, people let breakaways go. I mean, anybody can cover a move. So you know, I, that's the thing that I, I see. It's, it's it's a run race, but the bike's getting harder. I mean, even in those packs, it's getting harder. It's harder than it was three years ago.